Namaste Soul Tribe, Spiritual Healer, back to give you guys a message. Hi, my beautiful collective. I love you guys so much, my beautiful collectives. Okay, all signs. I, uh, I have a very important channel message, so I'm kind of excited to give you guys this message because I just received it, literally, okay? So when I was connecting with your guys' energy, give me a second. Oh, wow. I love um, connecting with you guys because we have similar ancestors. In case you didn't know, if you're watching my channel for a while and you really resonate with me, you feel a certain connection with me, I also feel a certain connection with you guys too spiritually because every time I'm connecting with spirit to see what message they have clear audiently, I, I get a lot of messages, guys. Like I get the most important message that's going to resonate with you guys. And um, the Most High God is really using me um, to give you guys the clarity and the truth of what's going on and um, to guide you guys to suddenly awaken and take back your powers and liberate yourselves from these people and get your um, whatever's owed to you guys, okay, and whoever's doing these things. So, yeah, I'm very happy and proud to be doing this. So when you guys are thanking me, I'm also thanking you guys for being here with me today and um, giving me a purpose and giving me um, my beautiful destiny that it is to give you guys these messages. Thank you. I love you guys. Okay, let's just get right into this energy. I'm going to just light the Palo Santo and clear the energy to protect me as I channel the messages to protect you guys, the viewers, while you're receiving the message, okay? To protect us from any lower vibrational karmic energies trying to distract this message. Yeah. Thank you, spirit, angels, and guides. Archangel Michael, join me now as I give the beautiful collective this important message that you guys have given me. Okay. Cleanse the energy. <clears throat> protect the energy. Protect my throat chakra because they're always messing with my throat chakra spirit. Protect my throat chakra as I get the message out for my beautiful collective. <clears throat> thank you guys for being here okay guys listen i have a important message here for you guys collective watching if you guys have been dealing with karmics if you guys have been dealing with a main karmic in your life pretty much more than one karmic but there's like a main karmic and this is someone that's very envious competitive that um put you out in the colds too many times pointed the finger at you laughed at you shamed you Threw dirt on your name, slandered your name, all the above. Ooh, I'm going to tell you guys something. And this energy came out in the fire sign reading yesterday. And this might be resonating with all the other signs as well. So that's why I wanted to do a collective message about this situation now. Okay, so there is going to be a classified letter collective. I was seeing this in my mind's eye. I was seeing the vision. Of someone knocking on someone's door with some official mail, a UPS mail, like, you know, those big envelopes that, like, um, come for the, like, the UPS or, like, the federal mail or, like, the uh, classified mail comes in this envelope. So, guys, I'm, I, I seen a vision of someone at your door knocking or ringing the bell. You guys are looking out the hole or the people and you're like, I don't know who this person is. I don't know if I should open the door. I don't know what they want. Being, you guys are having such a major awakening to everything that's been going on. And you know, people been using spell work left and right, lying, cheating, slandering your name, using your information, trying to uh, set you up for something. You guys feel this in your energy. This is your message. You have none to be afraid of, but you do have to answer your door. If this person is at your door and they have a certified letter in their hand, Please, answer the door. You need to sign for this letter. They can't leave this letter at your door or in your mailbox. You have to sign for this letter because it is classified. It is important information in that mail or letter. Please open the door. Let them in or actually open the door and sign for it. Because um, right here, someone close to you, collective, the truth is coming out to the light, that someone that's close to you stole your identity and committed fraud. And you will have to testify because whatever they did, they committed fraud. They got money. They did. They did something with um, your information. They were caught on camera. There's proof. They have their fingerprints. Wow. And this person um, also 
wow, I heard something Spirit say, oh my God, I heard somebody saying, oh my God, we, we don't got her, um, we can't get into her account, we can't get into her account. Oh my God, they changed the password, she changed the password. So someone's freaking out because you guys have changed your passwords for all your accounts because I guess you took my advice or you just intuitively you knew somebody was trying to get into your accounts, hack into your account. So you guys could have changed your password or passcodes and they couldn't get in. So this is another way that they got caught because there's proof somehow online, something they did on a computer, accessing your accounts with your information. Mm -mm -mm. I'm telling you, if somebody's coming to your door with a certified letter or certified mail and you need to answer that door to sign for it, this is important information. There's a private investigator, an investigator that knows <coughs> or a detective. See, they're already fucking with my throat. They're gonna. They already know. They already have enough proof. So they're sending you like a, a a certified letter or mail, and they're letting you know that all this shit has been done using your information, and that they know the people that are involved, and that there's gonna be an arrest, or that you're gonna you're gonna have to pursue because you need to clear your name now. Da 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 da. da. But this is gonna turn out in your favor. And whoever these people are that did this is karmic female and guy, a male, a couple, Bonnie and Clyde, whatever the hell they are here. They're both going to jail. And they're already in spiritual uh, prison. If you see this person or these people, they look sick. They're not looking well. They're not doing so well. Okay? Let's get the message spirit. Okay? I have other messages written down in my notebook for you guys, collective. Okay? <clears throat> I heard the name Angel. Amy, Sammy, Samantha, Carrie, Diane, Nicole or Nika, Nikki, Paula, Matthew, Lori, Leslie, Samantha, okay? And these are the names I got for now. If Spirit wants to give me any more names, I'll, I'll keep saying the names. I also heard Andrew or Anthony. Anika. Diaz. Diaz or Diaz. I heard Diaz or Diaz. Deja. Tori, Tanya, Lassiter, somebody's last name could be Lassiter or name could be Lassiter, Lonnie, Penny, someone with the name Penny, Patricia, Okay, spirit, let's get into the message. A karmic mother used separation spells, okay? Okay, guys, so you guys, you have a divine masculine that's awakening to this connection or a divine feminine. You could be male or female watching, and this could resonate. So you guys have a divine counterpart that's awakening to your connection. You guys have a soulmate connection, a past life twin flame connection. And there's a karmic mother figure, could be your mother or this person's mother that has been using separation spells, using food spells, food magic, um, gaslighting this person, this DM or this di divine feminine to go against you or to think that like you were the enemy, like you really not, not, you ain't shit. Like this car, this karmic mother was telling this person that you ain't good enough for them and that you're raggedy or that you're crazy or that you're this or that you're promiscuous or she was telling everybody she actually... Hook this person up with a real karmic, okay? This karmic mother figure, your mother-in-law or your mother or someone's mother figure here, this karmic female, hooked up your divine feminine or your divine masculine. This could be somebody's family, cousin, whoever they are. Mother, hooked up this divine feminine or masculine with a whole karmic. Introduce them to this whole karmic. So now they could be stuck in this situation here. And the only thing this person wants is to be with you. So I feel like these separation spells are breaking as we speak. You guys are getting the classified letter or mail. Something's coming out to the light. Everything is shifted. I have felt this shift on earth. I have felt it. Okay? So everything, it's like these people are going through spiritual purgatory. Everything they wanted us to go through. All the spells they threw on us. All the lies. All the slander. It's like the opposite now. It's like they're in that energy now. 
We have been, we have broken that curse. We're too powerful. We're too awakened. And the M is seeing his karmic mother as a snake. So your divine masculine or your divine feminine is seeing their mother figure as a snake or this person in their life, this karmic. And they're teaming up to keep you and your divine soulmate stuck. So these two karmics or all these karmics, are, they're teaming up now. But this divine masculine or feminine is looking at these people with disgust. And seeing them for who they really are. You have triggered this person's awakening, collective. You have activated something with, with inside of yourself. You have activated your God or your goddess within. And now your um, divine counterpart is actually telepathically communicating with you guys. Beautiful. That means you guys are about to come into union. You activated your soulmate. You're focused on your success, your happiness. You're glowing up. You're bossed up. Okay? You came from nothing to something. You had, you, had a, you had a struggle and fight just to keep your soul and your spirit intact. You had a struggle and fight just to come out of the, of, the, of the darkness that they all had you in. And now that you're powerful, you're a force to be reckoned with, you're, a, you're activating your divine counterpart. You are activating their awakening, guys. And you're being rewarded by spirit. You're being crowned. You're being chosen. You're being admired in the spirit realm. You're being celebrated. Also, your soulmate is watching you. If you're a reader, a healer, you have a platform, or you're just in the public eye, trust me, your soulmate is watching you. This person's admiring you. You're giving them strength. They're learning from you, collective. And they're going to fight for this connection. So be aware of the fake karmics. Okay, so listen, this is another message I have to give you guys before I stop talking and just pull some cards. Spirit said that... The devil, or the matrix, or whatever you want to call it, is going to try to have someone come into your life and pretend to be your soulmate, pretend to be spiritual, pretend to like be on the same wavelength. Please meditate on this person, or contact me and ask me if that's the right person, if this is your soulmate, because the devil sending you guys or sending us false, false uh, twin flames or fake soulmates. They're just karmic, and they're going to try to tell you everything you want to hear. They're going to tell you everything you want to hear, Spirit said. But this is not your soulmate. You already know this person you're meant to be with. Oh, okay. Or, yeah. Listen, some of you guys have a new person coming in that you guys have been um, communicating with, and they seem like they're like-minded. But before you jump into anything... Do your meditations, consult spirit, and ask them um, to guide you. If you guys are readers, pull your cards and do some, ask spirit about this person. You ask spirit about anybody that you deal with or you work with, okay? Protect your energy, guys. Spirit, give me some clear messages for the collective. What's coming towards their energy? Spirit, guys, and angels. Yeah, you know what's coming is a, a, there's a letter. There's a page of, of pentacles because there's a letter regarding money or regarding something that was done with your information with money or something that was kept using your information from you that's money or something like that. Answer the door, okay? Because I feel like you guys have a king of pentacles in reverse that have been working with a karmic female and these people were trying to scam you guys. Taurus Virgo Capricorn energy. Okay, they was literally working on behind the scenes to scam you guys. And one of the, and like I said, you could have been in a relationship or like you went out and dated or you had something with this person, with this masculine or feminine, and now they they're betraying you. This is somebody that you used to date and they're they're hooking they're they're hooking up with a karmic to do this to you guys. Be careful. Yeah, because you walked away from them. And they were pissed because you walked away from them. And you put that sword down and you stopped fighting with these people. You started focusing on yourself now. And you started to blow up. And they want a piece of that. They feel like they're entitled to that shit. Wow. So they're going to go do some shady things behind your back with your information and get caught. I heard the name Leon. Or Lion. Somebody could be a Leo. I see a lion here. A lion in this picture. Wow. But here goes the Ten of Pentacles. You guys are receiving long-term wealth, success, and abundance. Anything that's meant to come in that's yours is going to happen because this letter, this page of Pentacles is regarding some money that's yours, okay, that has been kept a secret. Yeah, because you guys have bossed up. 
you put yourself on the on the throne in your emperor mode, right? Taking care of business here, right? And you're no longer stuck or trapped and bound with all these swords because you woke up to your own powers and your gifts, okay? And you realized that was just an illusion. You were never stuck. Wow, because the secret is going to happen. You're going to find out everything, everything, everything when you get that certified mail, when you get that letter, when you get that proof in, 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 in the 3D in real life. Okay, but you are meant to be with this person and this karmic, these karmics were doing everything they could to sabotage this connection between you guys. Even some karmics lied about a child being your masculines. There's karmics that even lied about a child being a masculine just to keep them stuck from being with their divine feminines and they're all getting exposed as we speak. Yeah, like a lot of messages or communication coming towards you. And this is going to bring you the truth about the Ten of Cups in reverse. Mm, about someone that's losing things and losing their home or losing their money or going to jail or literally losing their freaking whole mind in bad health because they wanted to ruin your stable ten of cups when you had it. They wanted to ruin this connection here with you and your soulmate. They really wanted to. But it is divinely guided and protected by the angels because this is meant to happen. You guys were meant to be a power couple. Yeah, page of cups. Good news is coming, guys, and you're going to be celebrating with the celebration card. You're going to be very happy because this is going to happen suddenly, okay? And this divine counterpart, they want to be a family with you now. They want to work with you now. They want to give to you now. They want to do this right this time. Ooh, I got the chills. Yeah, this person's really manifesting, you guys. Gemini energy here. Yeah, but... You might have to go to court and testify. You might have to speak your truth because someone was trying to sabotage your life, trying to ruin you, using your information, scamming you, doing something, um, cashing checks. I don't know what they was doing. They could have been cashing fraudulent checks with your information, with your name. They set up accounts. Whatever they did, they're fucked. Whatever it is, everybody's situation is going to be different, but they're fucked. I'm telling you they are. Yep. And you guys will be reuniting with a child or children, and you're going to be so happy because you're going to win a situation in court. The letter V, W, X, or Y, okay? Wilson, Wanda, Juanita, Wendy, William, or Will, or Willie, Vicky, Veronica, Valerie, Victoria, Yahira, Yahira. Yasmin or Yasmin? Wow. Beautiful. That's actually my name, guys. My name is Yasmin, but not Yasmin. Okay? The vine is in control of all your blessings, okay, guys? The vine is in full control of everything that's happening. Okay? You guys, the letter P, Q, or R, I already mentioned names. Water sign female, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio might be involved. Might have something to do with the mix. Mm. Or maybe that's your divine counterpart for some of you guys. Okay. The message will be different, not for all. Spying through readings. They're definitely spying through readings. The karmics are teaming up because when they spy through readings, all they see is you becoming successful. All they see is you and your partner um, coming back together, having a divine union. And all um, they know is that this crooked lawyer is getting exposed. This crooked lawyer that was used by some family members is going to tell on everybody. 555 five, five is the major change in your life, guys. Okay? Yeah. And this is like the message that I came on here to share with you guys really quickly. I hope this message helped you guys. I hope it was of some help. I love you guys. And anytime I get a message, I'm always going to be coming back to put it on. If you guys need a personal reading, please reach out. They're very reasonable and affordable. I love you guys so much. Till the next time. Mm -hmm. Namaste.